So it's John Mountney to look ahead to Friday's Dublin Derby against Bohemians. It'll be live on LOI TV at 7.45 from Dalyman Park. There will be 100 Bowes fans at the game. John, first, just to look back on last weekend, the 1-1 uh, draw at the RSC against Waterford. Of course, Alfie Lewis got that uh, harsh red card after Maddie Smith had given us the lead. Shane Griffin then equalised. But the fighting spirit towards the end with 10 men for three quarters of the game, even though it was a point as opposed to three points, that can really bring a group much closer together, even though you're already a very close group and just that real sense of fighting for each other when you were down a man for most of the match. Yeah, exactly, Jamie. Um, every game we go into, you know, we're looking to to get to maximum points we can from them. But, um, you know, not everything goes to plan and not everything goes smoothly. And that's exactly what happened Friday night with, uh, with, the, with the sending off. All of a sudden things change. You're one nil up and you're down to 10 men and you're know, one all at half time going in and, and you know, we knew that there's there's good characters in the dressing room and, and there's um good attacking players that we if we if we, you know, kept our end of it clean and didn't concede any goals that it'd give our attacking options the chance if we could create one or two chances to to try and get something. And we did. We created a couple of good chances in that game, just uh unfortunately couldn't couldn't nick the win. But it, it, like you said, it uh, it showed uh, a different side of us that we were willing to work and dig in um and secure the point. Yeah, it's been a really positive couple of weeks since the mid-season break. Those three wins, two back-to-back -back at Richmond Park in front of supporters as well, and then the point in Waterford. So 10 points from 12, and, uh, you know, again, the confidence and the momentum in the group at the moment, and there must be a real good, positive vibe heading into Friday, given performances and results have generally been very good. Yeah, it's been it's been very positive. Like, we, we all came back in after the break, um, you, know, um, you know, ready to work hard and to... To get going again, and you know we were put straight to our paces, and, and we've we've come back, we've bounced straight back into it, like you said, with the points we've picked up. And uh, Friday night's of course going to be a tough game going away to Bohemians. It was a tough game there at the start of the year, and and when we played them last in Richmond, so it'd be a very tough game. And they're looking to bounce back from their their results against uh, disappointing results against Sligo, and you know we're looking to keep our good form going. So it it uh, lends itself for a good game. Yeah, both games this season won by St Pat's by a goal, one nil at Daly, Mondrone and Coughlin header from Robbie Benson corner and then 2-1 at Richmond. Robbie Benson comes on after injury and scores that last minute penno after Bowles getting the penno just beforehand and so on. So uh, they've been quite close games and I'm sure uh, Friday at Daly, will be no different. Yeah, exactly. Um, they're, a good, they're a good attacking team. You know, they've strengthened Bohemians this year and, you know, they've improved since we, since we played them last um, earlier in the season. So, uh, yeah, it'll be, it'll be a very tough game but, um like that, we're going there full of confidence too and, and we know what we're about as a team. So, uh, yeah, it should be a good one. And John, lastly, just on the supporters, we had 200 at Richmond for the Friday Monday against uh, Sligo Rovers and Finn Harps. So there'll be more there, hopefully at least 200, if not more, for the next couple of home games, back-to-back -back home games against Derry and Drogheda. But there'll be 100 Bowes fans at Daily Mount for an away derby on Friday. I believe they created a nice atmosphere for the Bowes win over Shamrock Rovers and some of the Shamrock Rovers players might have got a bit of stick, which is quite natural in a derby. So um, you're looking forward to being in, in an away ground, an away ground in Dublin with some supporters giving you a bit of stick and uh, cheering on the home team for them. And, of course, uh, getting on your guys' backs, which is, uh, I'm sure, something you'll expect. Yeah, there's, that's the best part about football, isn't it? Is uh, is playing in front of the fans, and of course, having having the two hundred in Richmond was has been a massive boost to us since coming back from the great uh, from the break. But um, playing away, it's also great have great having away fans because like that, there's nothing better to get you going than a bit of stick and a bit of a bit of noise. So um, I'm sure there'll be a, be a, a tension in the game between us. You know, two teams that are be you know looking to compete, and uh, you know their fans always make noise as well. So uh, we look forward to that side too.